try. A new week and some new music for the Wallabies' captain's run. Michael Checker confirming his bench for the do or die second test. Of course we want to bounce back. But, like it hurts losing. It hurts a lot. Like that's, that's, you know, there's no brushing that away and that pain still sits inside you, of course, you know, and that's usually what drives you even after you have a win to win again. That's why England will want to win again because they don't want to have the pain of losing either. The external pressure building on Australia, although that's not the feeling within the camp. There's no need to feel pressure in this game. You know what I mean? Because there's real serious things going on out there. And obviously we want to win. We're not naive of that, you know what I mean? But more importantly is we want to play our best like we always want to do. We want to make Australia proud by the way we play the game. The camp in Melbourne giving combinations the extra time to gel. Our second week together is, is better than the first week, you know, and that's important. So the intensity's been up a little bit of training. Our combinations have been a little bit better. So that, that stuff helps a lot in your preparation. But... When you lose the first game, it's just uh, the nature of it, isn't it? That you've got to you've got to find that that way to improve and get better. Rob Simmons, a casualty of the loss in Brisbane, dropped for the second test after most thought it was no mission because of injury. I've never heard of the phrase "guaranteed selection," like selection guarantee. That that's that doesn't for I don't know for people inside footy teams. I don't think that's a, that word ever goes. Yeah, and the minute someone's guaranteed, so it feels like he's guaranteed selection, he's never going to perform. You know what I mean? Sure, you don't want them stressing about things or whatever, but you've got to know that this is the national team and there's a lot of players that are vying for the one jersey. And that's the way it should be.